Prince the producer MMA animals coming at you guys, man. Here to get my weeb on today. I love this game. Like, I think this game is, is amazing. I would love to see a bigger version of this game. Like, this game on a much larger scale because it's only 8 gigs. But them 8 gigs are, in my opinion, just greatness. Like, the things that you're able to do and that you have to do figure out is ridiculous man like it, it doesn't give you any help <laughs> like like dude like you know what i mean you just got to get on here and put your brain together or hope for a guy like me or other youtubers that are dropping info on this game but i stopped playing it for like a few months or whatever after i after i unlocked uh bipedalism after i put the by bi, the bipedalism in in the genes of my clan or whatever or lineage uh i don't know why i just fe i felt like the sense of accomplishment i guess and i, I just kind of just stopped playing and you know moved to other things or whatever but i got back on it the other night last night rather and dude i was just, it was just still breathtaking to me i was like dude this is amazing there's so much that you can explore and discover in this game this is crazy, dude. But we're gonna jump right into this, man. You know, I just wanted to do this little, this little video. I'm I'm actually gonna start doing more uh, streaming this and uh, doing little videos for it. But um, yeah, man, I've been in this area that I am currently in for a few generations now. Or whatever um see how i got everything set up i got uh you know granite and obsidian tools and precious stones and stuff like that that help you conquer new areas make you feel good and you know when you're going into new areas you know what I'm saying to remove that inducence of fear and look yeah look at all that bro you know what i'm saying we just scouting everything or whatever i was in that area I guess the last time I played before I took that little month or so hiatus, I was scouting for new areas to go or whatever to expand the domain. But, uh, yeah, I had to make my way back over here. Got whole attacked by a saber tooth that's been ridiculously persistent. Like, I don't know how many times I gotta stab this thing. You know what I mean? You that I'm in year 225 that's two centuries two two and a quarter century that I have been being stalked by this creature bro you'll see him in a minute in the video when I do it or whatever it's like this dude's got fucking six spears or sharpened sticks sticking out of his body I'm like bro how do you how, how did you not die off decades ago from just roaming the jungle with uh, spears implanted into your body from a group of hominids. It's crazy. But, yeah, dude, I'm supposed to go on another little exploration right here. Or whatever, just gotta get everybody, gotta get everybody in tune. You know, get some, get some food up in them, get some water. Make sure everybody's ready for the trip. Make sure they're equipped. I got a pile of weapons actually over there. That I can just go grab, make a mimic, me you know what I mean? And it's just boom. Now, comes the neural network. This is one of the things that I love about this game so much is the neural connection process, the cognitive exercises. 
and just overall intensity of the survival in this game like it's crazy you got things hunting you at all times and it's just wild like unless you make refuge nowhere is safe in this game i was when i first started playing this i was in a tree like in the earlier parts of the earlier areas not even a part just the earlier areas of the game that you start off in and uh, i was like high up in this tree or whatever just you know just looking at the graphics and just you know looking out how far i can see detail and stuff like that or whatever and uh dude this fucking prehistoric eagle just like snatches me out of the air like you know what i mean i'm and i'm done like i i fall to death and as a result of this game not really giving you any instruction or you know guide or as to what to do in the game or whatever at the time in the game most of my fucking hominids die off bro and i'm down to a baby an adult and an elder and bro, i can't do shit with that elder like can't make babies or anything so i was basically just forced to start all the way over anyways i'm getting ready to start an expedition to go find the father tree which is evidently located in the middle of the fucking jungle so i made it a point before i made this expedition was to unlock bipedalism because i feel that it gives you a significant advantage when <laughs> traveling at, at the state that we're in you know what i mean because being on all fours through forest jungle floors is not the best thing to you know intercept danger so yeah i made it a point to go ahead and do that now that i've done that rally up everybody here and we are fenced to make that first step now the rest of the expedition will be basically i guess in series because i'll put them out try to do try to do try to do two a week and uh see if we can find this father tree and after that i'm gonna make the move to the savannah try to get out there in the desert and get some of this hair off of us and uh see if we can start stepping further to that uh to that human phase
But yeah, if I haven't told you before, uh, the dude, the bone, the bone is the way to go. Like it is the way to go, especially when you're traveling long distances, because it's unbreakable. So like you can get continuous hits on whatever animal is trying to fucking attack you, or whatever. The sticks, I mean, I, I like them, but. Yeah, you know, it's a one-hit thing. You know what I mean? If that if that animal decides to come back right after you stab him, like you're out of there at that point. No weapon, and yeah, so you just gotta watch it, man. Look how, look at look look at the clan, all up on the two feet. Look at him. Bipedalism. Look, strut, young nigga with the bone club. <laughs> Alright, we finna all make this move begin the move anyway like i said the rest of this will be in another video so if you don't want to miss that uh like and subscribe man show the boy all the love all the support that you can and i'll keep dropping shit for sure look at him he trying to get away we're not doing that like i'm i'm, I'm ready to end this i'm ready to end this fucking two decade rivalry that we have stalking case really yeah, we gotta we gotta put this dude down. You know what I mean? Nah, we're not running. We're not doing none of that. Ah, oh, messed up the timing. Ah, oh, sorry guys, I didn't mess up this time, like, fucker. <laughs> Baby's on the back and all. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Straight savagery, dude. See, that's what I need right there, man. Y'all, uh, like, man, don't forget to subscribe, man. Right? Show me the love. I'll catch y'all next time on the next video. Oh, my God. That was dope. I'm going to holler at y'all. MMA Animal out, man.